welcome everyone to your full moon reading for December. This is the last full moon of the year. Woohoo! Getting ready to go into that 2024. This moon is the cold moon. So, okay guys, let's see what's going on over here. Best message coming out for this full moon it's a great time to manifest make sure you guys are manifesting since the vortex will be open um it's also a great time to release things as well as you clear your energy um so let's see what's going on so it's like let go release cleanse right so that we can get ready to manifest okay best message is coming out please is Oh, talk about release, ancestral realm, karmic cleanse, healing the lineage and boundaries. Well, that's very interesting because that's exactly what the full moon in Cancer really is. It's about releasing the family karma and bringing in the inner peace and stillness um, within your life. Um, being that it is in Cancer and Cancer is that, um, that sign of family, right? Um, and then, of course, you have the moon on top of the moon, right? Because Cancer represents the moon. So very, very powerful um, energies going on over here. Let's see what's going on. Next card coming out, please. Uh, this is Sword of Light, Divine Protection, Cut the Cords, and Breakthrough Energy. So, woohoo. Loving that. Give us another one on the Ancestral Realm, please. Karma. Dharma. Hmm. Shambhala invitations. Or I'm sorry, initiations. Uh, retreating to recharge, trusting in the process, and Dharma. Just talking about that process of where you're going within your life. I love that though because this is also going to illuminate thinking. Just think about that cancer. It's a cancer card, guys. What does cancer do? What does the moon card do? It brings in what? The stillness. It brings in the illuminating, the dreams, and the desires as it also awakens the intensities of our in intuition, bringing in the secret, the secret gifts of our what desires and dreams. Oh, what a Christmas and a new year. Uh, this could be, you know, for potential miracles to arise. Wow. So um, going over here to the sword of light. Yeah. So give us another card over here. Dropping shields, higher heart activation, divine love, your heart is healed. Wow. Okay, so. Fulfilling soul contracts coming out on that karma. So whatever you're releasing from your karma, your soul contract is done. It's over. It's done. It's healed. It's, it's, that's it. It's going to bring in the willpower, the, the fire within. Like I said, bringing in also that stillness you know, and that intensity of wanting to go after your new desires, your dreams, your manifesting, um, your heart's desires, conscious manifesting with the Emerald Tablet activation. Your mission is uncovered. There's that Dharma. This one actually should be on the other side, but it wants to put it on the cutting cords, so that's fine. And this is the order of the Melchizedek. I don't know. I can't say that, but however... Um, embraced by the light, mission uncovered. Don't give up on your dreams. Don't give up on your, you know, <clears throat> things you want. It is time for you to shine, my friends. Time to shine as this is ending a cycle. It's ending not just a cycle. It's ending the whole year. So the year is a cycle of our life. Every year is a cycle of our life. We get older, right? Next year we'll be one year older than we are this year. So therefore this cycle is, right, is ending. So... Let's go over here. Did get these new cards for Christmas. They're really cool. So, <clears throat> let's see what's going on over here. Wow. That is the Ace of Swords, too. So, I just want to bring that in really, really quickly. That that's going to also be a very good thing for this new moon as well. As it's bringing in that inner clarity, right, from those things that were once hidden from sight you can now feel like your intuition is opening up if you guys have felt like you've been foggy i can't use my intuition something's going on i feel like i'm fogged out i can't clearly see now everything is going to intensify through your emotions for you to be able to see right as your yeah as your star is coming out so hope calm there's that calmness that inner stillness that inner calmness and healing path 
the purpose, the renewal, the great fortune, feeling more rejuvenated. The devil coming out. What is that? It's in reverse. So this is what? Releasing any karma, any limiting beliefs, right? Anything you didn't feel like you had the willpower to do, you're going to feel like you have the willpower to do now as that solar chakra is going to be activated through this situation. Um, and over here on the ending, the cycles of the sword of light. Clarify on these cards for us, please, spirit. Wow, this is... Yeah, feeling like the new beginnings of possibilities, trusting in life, having the blind faith. There's that optimism, feeling like things are possible again, feeling like, you know what, I'm moving in the direction that I can feel like I can move in as everything is coming together. And you're going to start probably seeing the fruitation of your wishes starting to come through. Here's the moon on top of the moon. <laughs> For the moon is what? It's mysterious. It, you know, it... It shows illusions. It shows all these things. So anything that you felt like was an illusion, anything that you felt like was holding you back that I couldn't see within my intuition is now clear to see. You could have a little bit of anxiety from this full moon. I just want you to know that. Especially those of you who have a lot of water in your chart, um, you're going to feel this. A lot of people are going to feel it anyways, whether you have water or not, because it's a pretty big moon. Um, it is the cold moon, right? So it's telling us here comes, you know, here comes the, uh, ooh, yeah, anything that you felt like you've learned anything from, you're having reflection upon. Well, of course, you're going to have reflection. It's the moon in itself, um, but there could be some big news coming, some very important news, some very important information coming your way, right? Things that you're looking for, things that you've been waiting for. Right. And it could have been things you've been waiting for for all year long is finally coming into fruitation, finally coming at you, finally rushing towards you and making you want to feel inspired. It's also going to be very inspiring to want you to be very curious about what it is you want next year. I'm really now pushing you to the next limit with the full card saying now I'm ready for this new cycle. I'm ready for it. This new um, this new adventure, this new journey. Right. Okay, so let's see what the moon cards have to say. Just some advice from spirit. When this moon comes in, as the portal is open now. Attune to the divine. So it's time to attune to the divine. It's a time to manifest. It's a time to get yourself to, yes, believe in the good luck that you do. And you do deserve and that you are looking for and leave the past behind <laughs> which i love that anyways let's look towards the future anyways because we have a whole new year coming so okay yes and like i said your emotions are probably going to be going crazy which would you know be a great time to meditate anyways get your you know pushing through yeah pushing through any kind of insecurities from the moon cancer this is the first quarter moon in cancer Find your balance. Spirit says it's time to find some balance within your life. It's going to be okay. Reveal what needs to be seen. I love it because we were just talking about that, that revolution, or the revel, revelations of things that are coming to light, the clarity of things that, you know, what is it, you know, is it uh, pushing its way through? I don't know what it was. Now I can clearly see what it is. And an overall of the situation is be proud of yourself. Because you know what, you went through everything, you stepped into your power, and you know what, always practice gratitude, no matter what, as you're releasing control of the situation. And you know what, it's the end of the year, guys, so go wild. <laughs> go wild and enjoy yourself. Enjoy yourself, right? Okay, my friends. And that was it for you. Until next time. And if you guys need any manifesting tips, there are manifestation um, videos. Um, in the playlist so there's a bunch for every sign okay so you guys can look at those to help you meditate learn to meditate however it is you need to do okay until next time peace and love bye-bye